This is how you know you're in a comedy club. It's not even six o'clock in the morning and I'm already at the airport. As you can see, I'm getting old. Looks like I've been in a fight with Conan McGregor or something. But um, yeah, off to Amsterdam and tonight's gig. So I'm excited but really tired. Let's find the gate. Fully booked flight, I got my own row. It's gonna be a good day. This is the first time I'm going to do a gig in Holland. Yeah. And from, yeah, it's going to be really cool. I hope it's going to be really cool. <laughs> but what I've heard is like Dutch audiences can be really good, but they can also be really harsh. Yes, they, you have to prove yourself first before, you, uh, before they will laugh. So you first have to say who you are and then show them that you're funny and then they will laugh and eat from your hand. But there's a sort of uh, time they don't like you instantly. You have to first show them that you're funny. Uh, okay, so you yeah. mean that they're not going to be supportive in the beginning? No. No. No, <laughs> no they're harsh. So how many comedians bomb here? Oh, on a tryout uh, open mic or normal No, English normal show? evening. Oh, not, not many. Uh, the English nights are a little bit better. Uh, so they're more willing to laugh uh, than the Dutch nights. No, that's, so that's, that's good. positive. Yeah. 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 And another positive note is that I've just been in New York and Brooklyn, yeah. which is supposed to be the toughest audiences in the world. You'll be fine. I think I'll be fine. Yeah. We'll see uh, in a couple of hours. Welcome to Amsterdam and this hotel where they welcome you with a giant cock of cum. Yeah. Mm. I've honestly never seen more bikes in my whole life. Even if I would be in a bicycle factory, it wouldn't beat Amsterdam. Honestly, I think these people are born on bikes. Like that they're literally cycling out of their mother's vaginas and going bling bling move it <laughs> unreal for good luck and not having any friends <laughs> so i'll drink with you cheers this is nice sitting down by the um, central station and I'm gonna have some Wurst and a cold beer and then sound check. Comedy Cafe 1994, yeah, here she is, madam. Hi. Yeah, that's it. Okay, nice. Nice, nice. You see, oh, it's you, this is like the Godfather now. It looks like uh, some kind of Sometimes my English sucks so much, especially just before gigs. One, two, three, check. Yeah, sounds good. And okay, then I'll go up to... Yeah. All the way from Sweden. Boo! One, 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 one. Sound check time here in uh, Amsterdam and Comedy Cafe. And look here, it's two hours left until show and it's already more people than most gigs I did in New York. <laughs> it will be such a fun night. But you are actually looking right now, ladies and gentlemen, at the guy who was voted Comedian of the Year in Sweden. Woo! 2001. <laughs> Here I finished third, and I gotta say, I was disappointed. I was really disappointed because there is only three of us. <laughs> <laughs> but no matter how this gig will go tonight, my first gig here in Holland, it doesn't matter because it can't be worse than my first gig ever in England. 
I'm going to tell you about this. It was in London a couple of years ago in a club called Up the Creek uh, in the south of London. And I walked up on stage and I said, hello everybody, uh, my name is Morton Anderson and uh, as you can tell, uh, I'm not from here because uh, I got nice teeth. <laughs> not their response. <laughs> not at all. One guy stood up in the back, he shouted, Yeah! You do know, you fucking wanker! <laughs> See you after the show! <laughs> so now I have new teeth. <laughs> it's quite obvious that uh, I've done this in a second language, and uh, actually, it's my third language, if you count dirty talk. <laughs> really? After all the stuff you've heard the other comedians do, that gotta ooh. Then you should leave now, because now I will start doing dirty jokes. You know why? And I don't do dirty, uh, dirty talk in Swedish. I'm not stupid. Of course, I do it in German. <laughs> don't we all? Doesn't matter where you're from. Of course, you do it in German. Because everything sounds disgusting in German. <laughs> I love you. Ich liebe dich. <laughs> so, break it up. Ich liebe dich. Fucking hell. No, so, uh, so I do dirty talk in German because it sounds more like you get into the. Yeah, that is good. Sehr gut, ja? Du leist meine Schlange in deine Hose. Ja, vielleicht will du deine Achloch spritzen. Ja, sehr gut in deine Achloch. Yeah, Fritze! Spritz the Satsi, I Yeah, that's Gilich Mali, you've got really good seats here now. Schmeck das! Schmeck das in deine Mood! Yeah, that's that is was. Schmeck das! So, I have a lot of spare time. I spend a lot of nights alone in hotel rooms. So, this is the Amsterdam tour with Morten Andersson. We are now going to take him into no, just no Canadians always. in the picture, please. He please, always, uh, just, this is his whole just thing. walk on, just he walk on, Mr. Anderson. Just no, never mind. Bacula bone structure <laughs> that he can take. Time to say goodbye from Amsterdam. I've had a blast being here. The gig was a lot of fun. Still have a lot to work on, but hey, um, I've just started my international kind of journey. So uh, I'm still happy with what I did. Now it's time to go to bed. Tomorrow, back to Stockholm and Sweden.